Hello and welcome to another video in our DevOps Digest series. This week we're talking all about GDPR and I probably don't need to tell you what GDPR is because it's been in the news a lot. There's everyone's talking about GDPR but first of all let's just touch on what it is in case you're not familiar or just as a recap. So GDPR is the General Data Protection Regulation and it's coming in into force on May 25th and what it says essentially is it's about improving protection of personal data and data subject rights. So what is defined as personal data? So you've got uh, IP addresses, uh, obviously a name, telephone numbers, email addresses, anything that could be related back to a person is considered personal data. Now, how does this actually relate then to your SDLC? So uh, through uh, ClearVision, through one of our partners, Sonotype, we can uh, help you when building software, make sure your software is secure so you cannot be breached and have that data leak because the implications of a data breach through GDPR are huge fines. So ClearVision through a partner Sonotype can help with the uh, stopping your application being vulnerable to attack so then you don't get these data breach. So the Nexus platform can Sonotype can help in two ways. First of all, there's breach notifications from Article 5 and Article 22 of GDPR and privacy by design from Article 25 of GDPR. And they can be sorted through the lifecycle application and the firewall application. So the way it works is when building software, 78% of companies use open source components from the internet or from Maven repository. So developers, it's easy. They just pull down the open source code. They can just use it to help build the application. Problem is, is you don't actually know any security risks around that. Uh, and the biggest example of that is the uh, Equifax and the struts vulnerability. So Equifax was using struts. It got, obviously, there's a vulnerability. Equifax got hacked, all the data got leaked. And you can read up on articles and how that went well for them. And then really, it can kind of help in uh, the Sonotype in the Nexus platform in these four main areas. And that's threat assessment, security testing, environment handling, and policy and compliance. So just to quickly dive into those. So threat assessment, we can... Uh, evaluate uh, the risk of any third-party components you've been using. The second is security testing, which can help us establish those release gates that's mentioned in the GDPR article for security testing. It can help with the automation as well. There's environment handling, which is the identify the critical uh, security upgrades that we need to quickly implement on those patches. And then there's policy and compliance. So we can put in policies within the life cycle of our SDLC, which will stop us implementing bad known components and those which are out of date or that need patching. So thank you for watching this video on GDPR. If you want to get in touch with us to talk about more about GDPR, then use the link below. So if you have any comments about GDPR, please do comment below or contact us. We are also available for a free application health checks. We can show you some of the vulnerabilities you may already have in your system, which you may not know about. Uh, so it's a completely free service. Please contact us. And join us next time for our Metrics That Matter uh, video that Lewis put together. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm.